My name is Timothy Trespass, and I'm a human being who's found himself targeted, given Morgellons disease, whatever that syndrome is, attacked uh, spiritually, emotionally, physically, and uh, suffering. Uh, making this video in the sunlight here to show you some of the things that have changed uh, about my body. Um, as you can tell, my hair has a very different sheen to it depending on the direction and the angle. Um, it's my belief that uh, using photonic uh, biology, synthetic biology equipped with uh, metamaterial to uh, photonic interaction um, that basically uh, filling the atmosphere and everything with uh, nanoparticulate smart dust that could uh, provide the necessary uh, reflective glint, uh, angle, index, diffraction uh, that using uh, lasers or higher higher frequency RF, uh, possibly even using background radiation, but definitely very, very small uh, radiation, and recording it, uh, illuminating everything and recording the, ref the reflection and uh, basically creating a hologram uh, that you can record in a holographic data form and then play back. And what that will give you is a three-dimensional picture of everything that you can interact with, that you can turn, you can walk through, you could climb up and out and in and under and um, add to that uh, internal, uh, let's say, for instance, magnetic resonance imaging contrasting agents or other photonic interactive agents <clears throat> to provide contrast uh, <clears throat> you can image you know, internal processes of the body as well probably to some cellular level you can do amounts of various chemicals neurotransmitters whatever biological parts um, exactly you can also uh, create processes or bacteria that produce uh, chemicals, drugs, bacteria, you know, whatever, uh, I'm sorry, uh, whatever you need. Neurotransmitters, you could be using synthetic biology design, something to create those things inside the human being. And uh, since the atmosphere has been made more conductive by adding nanoparticulates to it, all the conduct, all the atmosphere, and us, uh, and everything is more uh, energetically conductive, and uh, which means that this information can be transmitted through the air in ways that it never could before. Um, anyway, I wanted to show briefly my skull shape. Let's see if we can get it right here. As you can see. Uh, there's some serious changes to the way my skull is formed because these parasitic creatures inside of me and whatever electromagnetic whatever they're doing is eating away at the flesh and muscle and 